Mm. Greetings, Earthians, Welcome. many Earthians. This is Almatok. Greetings, Almatok. Thank you so much for letting coming through today. Um, it's a pleasure to have you as always. I know we only had a chat a few nights ago, but I want to welcome you to the Huclo webinar this Saturday. Um, we are having a, an unusual webinar today, as you're probably aware of. It's not our regular thing, so uh, we have yeah. lots of people here wanting to ask questions, interact with you. But first, I would like to ask if you have anything you want to say, an introduction, or anything you want to to share with us, impart with us, um, please feel free to do so. Certainly. There is something that does come to mind very quickly. I would like to address the wondrous being we know as Chakur. Now I understand this is a, for, a public forum where her message may reach far and wide. Now I wish my message to reach this far and wide also. Takur has touched many lives. She is a constant visitor amongst the Hukulu community. I doubt there is one such member who has not come into contact with Takur at some point. For this very reason, I would like to point out with much love and gratitude as often as I am able and given opportunity to this wondrous being we know as Takur. She has been incredibly active, far more than you perhaps would realise in realising the dreams and hopes and desires of alien lives interacting with human ones. She has created a love for our human colonies held amongst Gurkvik now. She is very active in the meetings of the Great Assembly. She is very active in the meetings of the governments of your countries. She has moved and elevated your wishes forward at a speed which you would possibly not believe. So I would ask you, please, on opportunity and when you are in private session, should she be one to visit and greet you, please, I request that you give true and deep thanks and gratitude. Also, to others of Gurkvik now, who you may come across as you journey through Hugo. But yes, most definitely, the wonderful Takur, I ask you all as you lay your heads on your pillows this evening and as often as you may remember as you lay your head on your pillows in every evening, send her thanks, please as well if you have hybrid children that she is active in their well-being in their directive of growth please send your hybrid children by name your message of love also I ask you please reach out to the parents of your hybrid children. There are concerns amongst the colonies, there are concerns amongst the colonies through the Galacti where this same purpose is being aimed for. There is concern as I said amongst the parents, the alien parents, as our human hybridized children grow and become individuals and show very human sides of themselves. This at times may lead to confusion, it may lead to misbehavior and this is foreign. So there is a request that has been made and has also been mentioned by myself throughout this coming week as we approach today 
be mindful that there are parents that are rearing your hybrid children. They would be grateful for any advice you may impart if you are able to learn the names of the alien parents. If you have been blessed with that, then please use them. If you have not, it is absolutely fine. Address them as the parent of your hybrid child's name that you did introduce to me. Please keep an open dialogue if you possibly can. If you listen in your quiet time with your head on your pillow and you send a message, allow approximately five to seven minutes and you may well receive a reply, a question, a request for further elaboration, please do so. Please do so. This is a true coming together of alien and human worlds. May we rear these children together. We may make them greater than even we first, first thought simply through co-parenting. So I would like to simply bring this to your awareness. And thank you for taking heed and thank you in advance for your communications with the wonderful alien parents of our wondrous hybrid children. Thank you. Thank you for that message, Amatok.